Okay, this is the proof of the area of a triangle being given by the formula half uh, AB sine C. So the following is uh, just a, a random triangle, uh, no particular type of triangle, uh, triangle ABC. Okay, and just note that we've got the base here of, of B and we've got the perpendicular height here H. Uh, we've got angle A, angle B, angle C. Okay, so they're the vertices of the triangle. And we've got side lowercase a, side lowercase b, side lowercase c there being the side, the opposite sides of the triangle. So it actually looks like a sine rule or a sort of a cosine rule type problem um, where you've got sides and sort of uh, sides and, and opposite angles. And but let's start off. Uh, what we do know is that the area okay, of triangle ABC okay, is in fact given by half base times height. So half times the base, times the height. Okay, so this is something that's been established some time ago. The thing is though, is that we're not given the height. Okay, what we are given is we're given angle C, we're given the base B, and we're given this side A here, which is actually the the hypotenuse of um, this, this triangle here. In fact, I might just put a, a capital D there. So in triangle BDC, okay, this, side A is just the hypotenuse of this triangle, right angle triangle BDC. Okay, so what's then H? So if we're given C, okay, we really need the H here. Okay, so this this H is, is unknown. Okay, but we do know A. Now, okay, I might just, okay, sign of C is equal to opposite over hypotenuse. Okay, so making H the subject, H is equal to A times sine of C. Okay, so I might just label this formula there. So that's number one, so that's number two. Okay, so So substituting A sine C from equation number two for H in equation number one. Okay, so this H here, okay, we're going to substitute A sine C, okay, for this H here. So from equation number one, okay, area is equal to half times base times height, which is equal to half times base times. Now, instead of H, we're going to substitute a sine c, a times sine of c, which is equal to half b a times sine c, which equals half a b sine c as required. 